The Sandigan Bayan has junked the plea by former First Lady Imelda Marcos and her daughter Irene to recover the property sequestered from them in their dismissed 200 billion peso civil forfeiture case. In a 40-page resolution dated January 25, the court's 4th division said that the motion by the two members of the Marcos family seeking the return of the properties declared as ill-gotten and sequestered by the Presidential Commission on Good Government was junked for lack of merit. Following the dismissal of the said case in 2019, the Marcos has said that the freeze orders and sequestration on assets and the properties could now be lifted. In their motion on August 5 last year, the older Marcos and Irene sought the return of the recovered properties, which were denominated as frozen accounts, surrendered by virtue of compromise agreements, sequestered but not in the PCGG's custody, and those that were sequestered under the PCGG's control and supervision. However, the Sandigan Bayan in its resolution has said that it was timely for the PCGG to file an appeal on the dismissed case at the Supreme Court in August last year, which made the decision junking the case as not yet final. The court also said that the Marcoses offered, quote, offered no proof or reason how the property subject of this case are being dissipated. President Ferdinand Bombong Marcos, the son of Imelda Marcos, has yet to issue a comment on the issue.